What's up guys? So it's not hump day, but your girl's posting. Yeah, in case you didn't already know, which you probably do. Okay, by the way, if you like see these random stains on my sleeve throughout this video, I'm pretty sure that's paint because I just washed this shirt and like I've been painting stuff recently. So yeah, like I promise I'm not like a dirty human being who just like never washes their clothes, but okay, anyways. Haley and I switched days this week. Life was just insane and I knew I, ooh, that was loud. I knew I had to post this week because I fucking came up with the theme patting myself on the back. I'm pretty sure this is the first week I've come up with the theme. Maybe it isn't. I feel like it, who fucking knows, right? And what I don't get is when you were in a weird dream, it seems so normal. That's how I do not understand people who can lucid dream. I've only lucid dreamt once in my entire life and I don't know how I remembered that I was in a dream or like, I think I was like, wait, I think I'm in a dream. Cause I pinched myself and I didn't feel anything. And I was like, Oh, and then I think I woke up because I was just like, what the fuck? So that's literally the only time I've like known I've been in a dream. Every other dream I've literally thought was real life. I need to like learn how to lucid dream. Like I watched Shane's video about it. Like I need to just get in the zone and teach myself that shit because that sounds really fun. So like I said, no matter how fucking outrageous your dreams are, I mean, at least for me, I don't, I can't speak for all of us. Uh, it seems very real while I'm experiencing the dream. I've had some really like fucked up dark dreams that have to do with people like, I, I mm. Well, actually, okay, I'll tell a fucked up dream. <laughs> so, some of you, if you've been following my channel for a long time, which, like, maybe, I don't know, have you? You maybe know that in the summer of 2015, I went to Australia, which was great. I fucking love Australia, but the one issue about Australia is that it's, like, a 15-hour flight from LA to fucking Sydney. We had a layover in New Zealand, but, like, still, it was in fucking sane, and I knew, because I can't even handle, like, a four-hour flight. I'm like, fuck, I get so bored. So, I was like, I need melatonin. And if you guys don't know what melatonin is, it's actually a natural supplement you can take. And it's actually something our body produces like all of the time. It's just basically like a natural supplement that helps you go to sleep. It's not like taking a sleeping pill that you can like become dependent on. It's nothing like that. So my mom was like, okay, well, you're going to try taking some melatonin. So she was like, let's give you this one melatonin and see how it works. And it kind of worked. The next night she was like, let's try two just to see like if it helps more. Ladies and gentlemen, do not take two melatonin. You will have fucked up dreams you will literally have the weirdest darkest most fucked up dreams i think i've done the two melatonin thing twice in my life i can't remember the fucked up dream i had for one of them it must have been that bad that like i don't even remember it because i remember that i did remember it but like now i don't anyways the fucked up dream that i remember felt so real and for some reason i had like an aerial view of like what was happening so i live in a like fucking subdivision this is so this is so fucked up i was just like chilling like in the sky just like looking down at the subdivision so in the summer my mom drives a ford mustang and it's like a convertible it must have yeah it was the summer so um i'm looking down i see my mom driving in her mustang convertible and it was almost like if you're viewing something on the sims how you can kind of like zoom in like right on where you want to look so i was like zooming on into my mom and her car's still moving and it's like turning at turns and like going in like a square on streets Does that makes sense like going a block in a square and like this is so fucked up <laughs> this is horrible i get close to my mom and i realize her head is like this and she has a <laughs> it's not funny at all but like why did i dream this she had a fucking bullet hole in her forehead she got sniped from some sniper in their house but like her car was still moving it's not funny at all but like that's my really fucked up dream and i remember being really upset when i woke up because like it felt so real and I was like, oh my god, my mom's dead. I fucking love Chick-fil-A. So yeah, um, quick pause. This is a mukbang, mukbang? Mukbang, mukbang. Like no one knows how to say it. I really don't think even the person who came up with the word knows how to correctly pronounce it. Like literally no one does. So let's get into like a more upbeat, like happy dream. I remember a dream I had in middle school where I, okay, this is so weird i was chilling with my girl scout troop we were in a pond okay but like we're like shrunk down like honey i shrunk the kids but like really we're probably like this tall i don't know and we're chilling on lily pads in a pond okay we're just hanging out and we start to fucking have a tea party literally we're having a tea party it's me and like eight other girls sitting on lily pads that are like perfectly like situated but everything else seemed so huge so we were definitely like shrunken and then guess who comes to join us at this tea party like just just take a wild guess who joined us at this tea party who the fuck joined us at this tea party thomas jefferson yeah yeah as in like president 
Thomas Jefferson. Thomas motherfucking Jefferson like sat down on his own lily pad and we all had a tea party together. <laughs> what? Like who, what, when, where, why, how? Like this next dream I had the night before Donald Trump got inaugurated and I'm not gonna get into politics. I'm not gonna get into Donald Trump or anything like that, but just like keep that in mind. So like Donald Trump was like on my mind because I knew he was going to be the new president tomorrow. I was sitting at home and I was alone and usually my dogs are at home. Like my dogs are like, always at home I don't know why they weren't at home I mean it was a dream so but I was sitting at home alone and I hear a knock at my door and because I may be 21 I'm still eight on the inside I literally still like peer around the corner when there's someone at the door <laughs> because I yeah like I'm an adult and so I'm like the fuck so I don't see anyone at the door so that's usually when I walk towards the door to see if there's like a package that was left at the doorstep and there was a package it was actually like a one of those thin like manila manila envelope type looking packages like it was very thin like a document type package and I open it this envelope had an official letter from Donald Trump <laughs> and the letter said that he wanted to marry my mom but he needed my permission to like have an affair with her because she's married to my dad Keep in mind, dreams feel so real at the time. So I'm like, Donald Trump's trying to have an affair with my mom? But then at the same time, I'm like, there will be a lot of money involved. <laughs> so I'm like, contemplating like, hmm. In real life, I would, I would be like, fuck off Donald Trump. Like, she's a married woman. And he's a married man. Like, Donald Trump, what are you doing? Like, what would Melania do? WWMD, what would Melania do? And I don't really remember like what happened after that. Um, but yeah, Donald Trump wanted to marry my mom, and that was a thing. I hope you guys enjoyed hearing about my weird ass dreams. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to The Explicit 7 if you have not already. We are pretty fucking awesome. If you want to check out my channel, like, that would be cool too, but like, yeah. Also, be sure to follow The Explicit 7 on all of our social media because it be poppin'. <laughs> okay, that's all from me. Thank you for watching, and I will see you on Wednesday. Bye. <laughs>